October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month, guys. It may fit into this story that you're about to hear as it relates to the LaTruth family. Stay tuned. Hey, everyone. Um, I wasn't even going to get on here and address some petty people like um, LaToya Foster, whatever she want to go by. I wasn't even going to get on here and dress up because she's really nobody to address. But since she want to go on live and call out my name saying that Brianna pay my bills and stuff like that. Brianna don't pay nothing. She have helped me. Help me. And how can she talk when her brother and Brianna help her? And your bills don't cost that much. I, I have high bills. You live in a trailer park. So your bills don't add up to no probably no more than 600 a month. So yes, your brother helped you. Of course, you want to take up for him. And yes, he did beat on me. My oldest daughter, that's 19 years old, but she was six years old at the time, can verify that this man pulled a gun out on me when she was six in front of her and told me to shut the F up and quit talking. And you, I could text my daughter now and she would tell you, do you remember that? And she would tell you, this man whooped me with belts before and when I was pregnant with Desharia. This man had threw plates in my face when every time he get angry, tell me to shut the F up like always. Uh, let me see. He had drug me across the floor, had made me get carpet burn. Um, let me see. Sold my car when we was together, sold my car for a hundred dollars. Cause his got repoed. He needed me then. He sold my car for a um, hundred dollars. Um, it's 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 so much. He 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 like dating younger people, younger women, so he can get over on them, have control over them, being a narcissist over them, and and stuff like that. He know women his age ain't gonna tolerate the bullshit. Sorry, my language. The bullshit that comes along with him he's 41 years old and he's so stuck in his childhood moment because of mommy's issues that that's something he needs to deal with he he think every woman he meet that they supposed to deal with it i was in denial and go along with him all them uh 10 years the last two years of the 10 years of eight years was horrible like it was awful 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 arguing all the time in front of the kids hitting me in front of the kids just cheating everything so latoya before you come for facts and think you know what you talking about many man aka many man i'm not about to argue with somebody that look like a man with a wig i'm not i'm not about to argue uh you're not even worth my argument as far as you saying that my daughter i paid brianna for my daughter First of all, my daughter, let me explain to you, you talking about, I'm going to answer all your questions since you want, Manny Man want to get on here and um, talk some stuff. I didn't send my daughter down there and my daughter was wanting to go down there where her dad at. And the reason being, she didn't know who her dad was at the moment and she see who he was, see who he is now. That's why she don't want to live with him. She wants to live with Brianna. Bri Robert beat on my daughter a month ago. Until this day, my daughter still got marks from them bruises that she could physically show you if anybody want to see that he left on her. When you discipline any child, anybody, you don't leave marks on them. He gets so angry. When Robert get angry, he, he, he don't do it out of love or discipline. He do it out of anger of discipline. It's two different things. Two different things. But one thing you're not going to do is get on here and lie about me saying that my daughter's down there. Yeah, she living with Brianna, not Robert, not her dad, because she don't want to live with him. Who I don't trust him around my daughter because he have anger issues. He got psychological issues that he need to deal with on his own. He got mommy issues that he need to deal with his own. He got childhood trauma that he need to uh, do, deal with on his own sorry deal with on his own but many man you're not going to get on facebook and think you about to run your mouth thinking you know me 
let me tell you about the baby issue yes i had a child after we broke up i never told him that was his he wanted my child to be him because when we broke up he told me if you ever have a child by anybody else we done forever i don't want you anyway i don't want you this nigga cried in front of me because i had a child why you do this to me i can't believe you do this that's the first time i ever seen this nigga cry you was hurt even your even your cousin chris when he was talking to my sister at the time told chris even said that he was hurt by me having a child i never wanted a child by him ever i, I love my daughter now but i never wanted no child by him and he knew that it took me five years into almost six years into the relationship even have a child by him i never wanted a child by him ever so get that straight like because i knew how he was controlling he a cheater he a beater he abuser all that stuff but one thing you're not going to sit on here and lie about talking about paternity test he asked for the paternity test i told him in my living room when i was living over in the apartments that my my child at the time was not his i told him in front of his face he still wanted a paternity test i'm telling well he said well who is it who is it and i told him who to do was man how you gonna have a child by him i'm like it ain't none of your business i'm not with you i i still want a paternity test just to make sure she not yours i'm telling you so latoya before you speak on something get the facts right your brother need help he's an abuser he ain't no good i don't trust my child around him y'all all need some help because all of y'all got childhood trauma get some help and stay out of my business and until you upgrade on my level don't speak to me bye